lot of people say that New York is going in the gutter. I mean, a lot of people say a lot of things. I hope I can help you see beyond normalized perspectives. My reasoning for things is usually not what you would think. Hi, my name is Victoria Rose, and I am in New York City right now, uh, New Jersey, New York. And it's a very big surprise. I wasn't, I wasn't planning on doing this, but I'm with my best friend, Denai. You guys know her. And we're actually just, you know, casually, they're, they're looking at apartments, but like I'm coming along because like, I don't have a place to live. You guys already know this. And I'm open to ideas. I didn't really want to live in America, but if I could live with Denai again, I think it would be good. So we're looking at apartments. That's the long short of it. But this is the first one. I've never looked at apartment in New York before. Um, so we'll see. Let's go and look at apartments in New York. Hello. This is technically New Jersey. Yes, it's yes. technically in northern New Jersey, right outside Manhattan. So it's like another um, borough, essentially, of Manhattan. I don't know, like New York and like New Jersey and everything like really confuses me. I'm like, it's so close that it's confusing. So we're close enough to New York to say that this is New York, right? Yeah. So it's right across from like, you know, essentially Times Square is like a little up here, but it's like oh, Times Square. Okay. So this is the border of New Jersey and New York. Yeah, it's like cuts right down the middle. The first apartment was very nice. We are looking for a three bedroom apartment because it will be shared with three different people. We also are all creatives, so we really need our creative studio space. The washer and dryer unit is obviously great. The bathroom is a good This is so cute. We'll be splitting rent three ways, but even still, this apartment was too pricey for us at twenty-seven hundred a month. But New York housing is pretty low right now, so who knows if we can get a deal? A little shared backyard. Oh. Huh. All the apartments that we're looking at are outside of New York City, but there's public transportation into the city. So there's no way that you can get an apartment like this inside of New York City. That's how all big cities are though. Oh, this is so cute. Overall, this apartment had everything we wanted, but the price was a little bit too much. This is apartment number two. <laughs> It's not an apartment, but it's a tower, and uh, supposedly it's haunted, and it's called Devil's Tower in New Jersey, and a lady named Harriet um, connected it to her house, and she just thought it was a nice tower to look out upon everything, but lo and behold, she saw her husband cheating with on her right below, and we were saying, it's probably a bad place to cheat on your wife. She can literally see you in her tower. He's like, duh, 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 duh. oh, right here, we're hidden. Mm -hmm. But he wasn't hidden. She could see him from the tower. And you know what she did? She jumped from the tower and died. So now it's haunted by Harriet. Why? Why Harriet? Why, why Harriet's husband? You should have just, you should have. Just next time, go to your, go to, yeah. go to the homewrecker's house. Yeah. Not so if you drive around or walk backwards around the tower three times, Harriet will appear to you. So that's what we're gonna they, do. They filled in the tunnel and locked up the tower because of the ghost. Um, dangers because you could get pushed like Harriet likes to push people out the tower. She does. She's really angry I feel like I feel like if you were like a parkour person you could like get up there. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Okay, it's gonna Hold be on. hard. It's circular. It's really so, hard. She's like, just looking down she's like, like, oh my god. I shouldn't have Look at these I shouldn't idiots. have came out that first time after the people went backwards three times around. Now I have to like keep up appearances. <laughs> She's like, guys, like everything's done electronically. Like just Can I just haunt you through your phone? Can I haunt you through your phone? <laughs> We're up there. We did it. We accomplished Usually it. people come at night. Yeah, it's but... probably scarier. She's like, I don't come out at this time. It's not my hours yet. This is day two of looking at apartments. We're gonna look at three more today. We only looked at one before. So we're gonna look at three. Indeed, yeah. we're looking at three apartments today. Do you know confirmative's a word? Confirmative? Mm -hmm. I don't think it is. It is. 
but we could make it over. No, it is. Look it up on Google. This floor, this floor is not, not desirable. The second apartment that we looked at was very, very spacious. It was priced at 2,500, which is pretty good for a nearly four bedroom apartment, but the flooring was kind of weird. This is a maze. <laughs> this, this is so weird. Yeah, I know. Is there anything else? Are you hiding like any other rooms? This is like very strange. <laughs> The pros are that it had a cool kitchen, a good sized bathroom, and it was in a pretty good area. The only thing I hate is obviously the rug. The flooring is awful. The yeah. flooring is. I wish they would rip this up and just do hardwood floors. Okay. But so they don't want to? Like, they're just... I, it's work for them, you know? Like, like, I walked them to do so much stuff to their house that I'm like, I believe I need to pop them this, this place is big. It's a maze, but the rooms are so strange. Like you had to walk through all the different rooms to get around. It's very weird. I, I don't even know where I'm at. Like I get lost really easily. Where am I? Okay, this is the bathroom area. It's so weird. I'm like, kind of, kind of like it though, cause it's so big. Yeah, so it's pretty much. Oh, the floors. This floor is okay. nice. The floors. Oh, this one has an AC. Oh, this is more, I like this because it feels more white. Yeah. Well, the parquet floors are definitely better. Than yeah. The I like this one better. This is the third apartment that we looked at, which was in the same building as the second one, which the flooring was so much better, but it was the same layout, so it was pretty cool. This one's much better, the flooring upgrade for sure. Good lighting. Big. It's not even, it's 2,500. This one was 2,500, the other one was 2,500. And then it's up higher to get more lighting. It's whiter. I didn't know that you could get something this big really close to like New York, you know what I mean? Like in LA, this would be a billion dollars. The backyard and the basement need a lot of work. So this is apartment number four in a similar area. Oh, this is nice. And then, oh, actually, yeah. It's three bedroom and it has um, two full baths. Sorry? It has two baths. Yeah. One bathroom. Oh, I want some cock drops. To like search, these apartments are much more unique in um, New York rather than Los Angeles because these are like old. So like their layout is so much different than you know any other apartments that I've seen. So you did like search for things, it's a maze. The only thing about this one is this space right here would be the main like... Um, oh wow. Oh wow. <laughs> That's like right beside the window. <laughs> That's really nice, you can just go to the bathroom. We like the newspaper. Here it is. Oh, thanks. This is luxury. I'll be at the toilet all the time. <laughs> yeah. Flashing everyone. <laughs> yeah. That's something I want now. <laughs> Didn't know it was a possibility. This space has less space than the other space. How much is this one? So this is day three of our apartment searching journey. And I would really so prefer to go to, you can go through the hallway, it's just not an ideal solution necessarily, you know, like every time you go. Yeah. This apartment was absolutely beautiful, but it is a railroad apartment, which means that you have to walk through all the rooms to get around. Very high ceilings. I want to say I think this one's 24, maybe the other one is 24, 50, or 2500, but you're getting a free month, which actually brings it down a little bit. Oh, or maybe this is beautiful. But it's unfortunate because you have to walk through each room to get to the next room, so there's like no separated rooms. 
This was another really nice apartment, but unfortunately the second bedroom was just too small and dark and we want to have equally big and well-lit bedrooms. So unfortunately this one just wouldn't work out, but it was a good price in a good neighborhood and it was very pretty. <laughs> I'm gonna vlog real quick right here. Yeah, go ahead. <clears throat> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, I hope that enlightened you somehow. I am looking to probably move here. Um, and we're waiting to hear back on an apartment that we applied for. You guys can guess which one it is in the comments below, but we haven't heard back yet and I have to leave again. So we don't know, it's very up in the air. Stay tuned to see if we get approved or not. Uh, Getting an apartment is always super stressful. Right now in this area, obviously people are moving out of the city, so it's um, maybe we're more likely to get accepted because of that and the you know the housing market's low or whatever here. So stay tuned to see if I move to New York or if I do something else. I'm not sure what's going on yet. It's very up in the air. This is all a very fast decision that I made. So, but that's the only ones that I do make. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Who knows what's going to happen. I love you guys very much. Stick to Terrestrial. Bye.